Hey guys, welcome to the bonus reading for Leo. I hope you guys are all doing amazing. Sending all of you love and light. As usual, this will be a general collective reading. So this will not resonate with every Leo and it will not resonate with every Leo cross watcher. So please take it resonates and leave the rest. Please take a moment to also read through the description box, especially if um, it is your first time here. And if it is, welcome to my channel. I am not offering personal readings right now, but don't forget to like and or follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok if you're interested in collective readings. You can find the links to all three in the description box. Spirit, what does my Leo collective need to know at this time? Oops, hold up. Spirit, what does my Leo collective need to know at this time? What does my Leo collective need to know? All right, so we have the Page of Swords, the Four of Wands, the Chariot, the Sun, the Five of Cups, the Seven of Wands, the Queen of Pentacles, and the Nine of Wands. Give me one second, guys. I am back. So signs that I'm seeing here, I see Leo energy. I also see Cancer energy. I see Air, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I see Earth, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay. And I don't know. Did I mention Cancer? Um, hmm. Somebody is watching you and they're very regretful. Okay. Somebody's watching you in regret, sadness, depression. They're, they're dwelling over whatever went wrong between the two of you. That is my son's toy in the background singing. Um, a marriage could have been an obstacle here, guys. This person could have been married. Or this could have been somebody that was guarded towards commitment. Um, this person may have also chose to move towards somebody else. Could They could have maybe chose to move towards an earth sign. An earth sign. The sun... Somebody's also maybe realizing that they don't want to try to, they don't want to give up on this relationship. Hmm. It's like they want to reveal something to you, but they're not coming in to offer you anything. They're not coming in to communicate and they're not coming in to apologize. Maybe this person feels like they need to maybe focus on healing. They may be in the process of closing out some other cycle and that's why they're not coming towards you right now. Yeah, that could be what's going on. They're in the process of maybe closing something else out. That toy is so loud. All right. This person's healing from something else that like another cycle that has closed out in their life. And that's why they're not coming towards you anymore. But they're watching you and they're sad and they're in regret. But they're not making any moves towards you here. Hmm. I feel like this is maybe somebody that maybe chose the wrong direction. They chose the wrong person. Let's get some more clarity. I know a lot of you guys are saying that you missed hearing baby in the background. Well, you guys surely do hear him today. <laughs> I've been trying to film when, you know, I don't have him. Want to have a little bit of a break. Um, but some of you guys love hearing him in the background. So it's just a lot easier for me to get these readings done when <laughs> I don't have baby. So, Page of Swords, they're watching you, they're spying on you. I have so much desire for you, desiring you, desiring you, yearning for you. Why, well, so what, why are they just watching you? I dream about you a lot too much. I need more time. I told you this person's not taking any action towards you right now. They're not, I saw that. We had the Three of Wands in reverse. They're not, nothing's manifesting right now. 
It's like, it's just all in this person's head at this point. Tell me about the five of cups. Why are they in regret energy? Maybe because they, they were like not sure about you. They regret maybe not making a decision. I miss you. Do you? They're sad because maybe they also feel like you don't miss them. They're not sure if you're still thinking about them. Why are they in regret energy? I hope you'll wait for me. Yeah, they, they're worried that you're moving on from them. They're hoping that you're waiting for them to get their life together or to close out a cycle. Mm, I don't know. Four of Wands. Yeah, see, this is somebody that was not ready for commitment. They were very guarded towards it, very non-committal. But now they're feeling like they're ready to settle down and have something more serious and stable. Maybe even like, maybe this is somebody that didn't want to get married. Now they are thinking marriage. But this person's not sure if like, you'll still choose them or if you still want them or if you're still interested. If the offer still stands or you still feel the same way. Tell me about the Seven of Wands. I'm a very jealous person. What? What does this have to do with the four of the seven of wands? They are waiting for you. But what's this guarded energy? Let me hold you. So this person knows that you guys are guarded towards them. Some of you guys could have even blocked them. And they're they're getting jealous, thinking about what you could be doing. Because this person's not dealing. If you wonder if this person's out there dating again or dealing with other people, they are not. They are very much focused on you. I do feel like they're in the process of closing out some other cycle, though. I am going to say that. I lie awake at night thinking about... So they lie away at night thinking about your future. I lie awake thinking about our future. They want to move this along. Could be a cancer for sure. Your family won't like me. So they maybe know that you've told your family about what they've done to you or, you know, things that have happened between the two of you. They're just afraid that they won't have the approval from those that are around, that are close to you. Let me have you. This person kind of wants you to come. You guys could have blocked this person. So that's like, they're kind of wanting you to take some type of action so that they can like kind of weasel their way back in here. Let me have you. And let's see here. You matter. Yeah, this person maybe felt like you weren't important to them or that you weren't a priority to them, but they want you to know that you do matter to them. You are important to them. And they do want this new path. They have a lot of passion for you. They want a new passionate beginning with you. They were afraid of this connection and this love and of commitment, but they're no longer afraid. But I feel like this person still hasn't made the final decision to come in and offer you something. Mm. All right, Queen of Pentacles. This is Queen of Pentacles. I could be your... They were maybe trying to help somebody or save somebody else. Say bro, I can hear you. Let's see here. Could have been an earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Yeah, they were still trying to like save somebody or like make something work with somebody else. They were maybe making a romantic offer to somebody else and now they're sorry. They're sorry that they did that. Be more selfish. They were like maybe trying to like take care of, they had to take care of somebody or they were maybe financially supporting somebody. They were like putting this other person before them. I feel like they were maybe dealing with somebody that was greedy. If that makes sense, guys. They could have been dealing with somebody that was maybe using them for money or that they had to take care of financially. That they kind of felt like they had to save that person. I hope that that makes sense. It's like they were maybe doing a lot for somebody that they're realizing that they don't, that person doesn't even care about them. They were putting somebody before them that didn't even care about them or would not even do the same thing for them. And they regret now putting, making that person a priority over you. Yeah. The sun. Think before you act. So they have come to some type of clarity, but they're really trying to think things through before they take any action. This person just thinks you're kind of out of their league and they don't really, they know that you don't need them. Like I feel like they were dealing with somebody from in their past that was very like needy and reliant on them, needed them for money, needed them to do everything for them. But you're different. You're very self-sufficient. This person knows that you don't need them. Nine of wands. I am terrified. They're tired. They're terrified that you've given up on this. Or that there's just been too much, too much has happened between the two of you. And this person knows that they're not ready to come in yet. They know that they need more time to get some things together in their life. And they're, they're afraid that by the time they come in, that it's going to be too late. 
So let's see, what else do they need to know about this? They do love you. Yeah, they do. They know that they have love for you, but they don't know if you still love them. They don't know if you still look at them that way. And this person is very sexually attracted to you, okay? Or they feel very tempted by you. They feel very tempted to kind of break some rules to be able to be with you or, or to bring this situation together between the two of you. This person was maybe taking some bad advice. They were taking advice from some people that they shouldn't have listening or they were caring too much about what people other people would think about your connection some people maybe have, may have been advising them against you know bringing this connection together for whatever reason they could have also been listening to their friends about commitment like maybe their friends were telling them like not to get into a commitment maybe they have a lot of friends that are players or that don't want they that aren't settled down or that have no intention of settling down like it could have been the people that they were surrounding themselves with tell me more but now this person doesn't care. It's like they, they're realizing that they. It's like at some point they, they felt like they also didn't, that they did, they didn't want a commitment. They didn't want a family, but I feel like, yeah, I feel like their, their outlook is changing here. It says, I want to start a family with you. Like maybe they had some people that were advising them against like starting a family or settling down, committing, but this person's realizing that they don't agree with these people that they have around them and that they do want a family. They do want to settle down is what I'm seeing here. Is there anything else that they need to know about this situation? I kind of want to see, is there anything else that my Leos need to know? You hurt me. Yeah, I saw that. You guys maybe said some harsh things to this person, but it was like a harsh truth. It was what they needed to hear, but it probably did kind of, you know, hurt their feelings at the time. But I feel like they're coming to terms with the fact that, you know, that was maybe something that they needed to hear and that whatever you said was the truth. I still don't have all the answers. They're still lacking clarity. That's why they're not taking any action towards you right now. They're just doing a lot of daydreaming and thinking about things. Okay. Um, and they're hoping that you'll wait for them. I don't see them taking action right now, guys. Let's see here. But I meant what I said. What 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 did they mean? Okay, that card flew. Definitely light. I am addicted to you. This person has an issue with their ego too. Like their ego was keeping them from really coming to terms with their true feelings for you. Like this person, the feelings have always been mutual. But this person's ego has been keeping them from coming to terms with that. And we have definitely... Like this person could have told you that they did want to have a future with you and like they did want to have a future with you eventually. And it's like this person saying that they meant that, but they can't expect somebody to wait on them forever. So I do want to take this over to the extended reading. I want to take a deeper look and see what the future holds or see what, you know, get you guys some advice. Um, see what this person's intentions to, are and what they've been up to. Get some timing if spirit will allow. Um, if you're interested in that, the link will be in the description box. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you could take something from this reading. I'm not offering personal readings at this time, but don't forget to like and or follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok if you're interested in collective readings. But other than that, I hope you guys have a good rest of your day, and I will see you over in the extended reading. Bye.